Hey guys, it's Puff, and today I'm going to show you how to make a polymer clay cookie. So let's get started. Set you guys down here. And, um, okay. I'm going to show you guys what you need. So what you're going to need is, of course, some tan clay, some brown clay, and then for the tools, those are all... Those are the only clays you're going to need. For the tools, you're going to need this brush to um, give it color. So, um, yeah. You're also going to need these three pastels. Brown, yellow, and orange. Um, you're going to need an X-Acto knife. Um, and a, like, some kind of device to uh, texture. I'm just using this brush. You can also use some sandpaper as well. <clears throat> and you, if you want, you can also use this placemat. You can use a placemat or whatever. Um, and that's basically all you need. So, yeah, let's just get started. So, we're going to start off with a tin plate. And we are going to cut a little bit off with our chapter knife. It depends on, you can cut off as much as you want or as little as you want. It just depends on how big you want your cookie. So,. Then you're just going to um, kind of make it into a ball, so I'm just going to roll it out, and you should have something like this, just a ball. And then you're going to set it down, um, and you're going to flatten it like a dome, but not too big of a dome, like, you want it kind of flat, but like not too flat, if you know what I mean. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, and then you're just going to kind of make sure that it's round um, and that it looks like, um, like nice. And so I think that I have my shape that I would like, so that's what it looks like. And then I'm just going to set it back down and take my brush and just can just like attack it, <laughs> not really, but I don't really know how to explain. Just like, you know, hit it like that. And I'll show you what it looks like now. So it kind of looks like a cookie, doesn't it? Because it's got like the, the stipples. Now here's one way you can use, that was one way you can use um, to that was one way, blah, 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 sorry, I can't talk. <laughs> that was one way that you can um, texture it. You can also use a piece of sandpaper. Um, I'll just set this aside. Um, and so you basically just do this and you kind of like tap it. My sandpaper isn't so strong that it would actually work, but you know, I kind of use it um, to shape it kind of like a cookie. Now, cookies aren't completely round, so you can go around and just like kind of make it crazy. Um, you can make it into an oval or um, anything like that. And now, what we want to do is shade it. So, using your three pastels, you want to start off with the lighter colors down in the middle. So, So I'm just taking the pastel and rubbing it on my brush, and you can use yellow and orange first, and then you like start going to the darker, which is the brown, um, all around the edges. And so yeah, and then you can also use that a little bit into the middle, but not too much, because um, you don't want it to be too dark. Um, but, yeah. So, um, I'm sorry if you, yeah, I think you can see. I don't really know. Um, but, yeah. Um, and so, yeah. And once you're done with that, you just want to go once around with your brush again. Or your sandpaper to make sure that the texture didn't go away. Um, and... Yeah, so we're just going to use a little bit more brown, just all around, and um, our 
he should be in soon. So, yeah. And now I'm just going to take a teensy bit of orange and just put it on the top to lighten it. So, yeah. We are pretty much done with our cookie. Now, um, all we have to do is just make the little crevices inside of our cookie. So, here's our cookie. I'm just going to move like that right there. Okay. So, here's our cookie. And if you have, like, any kind of thin brush, you can also use a mini dyeing tool. But I'm just, since I have my brush right here, um, I'm just going to use that. And make the crevices inside of the cookie for the um, chocolate chips. Now, this is the fun part because you get to kind of explore. You can even use colored, um, colored clay to put in here um, to make it kind of like a little M&M um, cookie. And now I'm taking my brown clay and just cutting a little bit off with my exacto knife. So you're probably only going to need like that much. Not even because you're probably not going to need that much, but you know, I'm just going to need a little bit. And then you're going to roll it into a little coil. And I'm going to move this up here, right there. So as you can see, here's all the holes inside of the cookie. And then you're just going to take your exacto knife and you're going to cut the side and to make it look like a chocolate chip chunk like that. And then you put it inside the hole of the cookie. Um, that's there. Um, and so as you can see, there it is. I have really bad lighting right now. I'm super sorry. I don't really know. Okay, there it is. <laughs> um, but here it is. So, uh, um, your chocolate chip and cookie. And then you just want to cut it a little uneven. Um, I'll put it right up here. So, you guys can see. But I'm just going to take this piece and put it inside the cookie. And then we're just going to cut another piece off. Um, see, I like to experiment with my cookies and kind of do like M&Ms um, with the colored clays. But today is just going to be a simple little cookie. So yeah, and we're just going to add in the rest of the chocolate chips. We're almost there. We just gotta add in like three more. Um, but yeah, so going on to the last one. And, um, yeah. So I'm just kind of putting them in like so. And then, what you wanna do next? is just um, make sure that you like your cookie. Now, this is one of the more simplest cookies. I usually make mine more tedious, like, you know, if you know, like, what I'm saying. Um, but you can also texture the back of the cookie to make it look really, like, realistic. And take some brown. And just do all of the bottom because you know cookies are dark or on the bottom so yeah that's the bottom see this is more like um one of those cookies that you would um just like do randomly um but yeah so that's my cookie i'm just gonna set that in the pan um, and i'm actually going to bring you guys to show you um, one of my more, like, tedious cookies. Um, so, sorry guys, I'll just set you down this way. And, um, show you guys my more realistic.
realistic, I guess. I don't really know how to explain what the what I would call it. But let me grab it. So I made this one, which is kind of like a bitten cookie. And then this one, which is um sorry guys. This one, which is kind of like just a normal Sorry, I gotta focus it. More of the, like, normal chocolate chip. So, yeah. But, thank you for watching, guys. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And, um, comment down below if you want me to make more clay items. And, yeah. Bye-bye.